taking a friend on his first flight in an aircraft, and he handled it better than anyone. Are y'all ready to go? Yeah. It's over, B. <laughs> two. No turning back now. Uh, five at Kilo, right. It might be a couple minutes before we get to take off. They gotta clear the skies? Well, they gotta make sure there's nobody coming in for the runway and nobody on the runway for me. San Marcos Tower, Skyhawk 8091, holding short of runway 13, ready for departure. This thing's here on one, Sparkles Tower, hold short, runway 13, landing traffic. Hold short, runway 13 for landing traffic, 80991. Just a 590 uniform, contact ground, leaving the runway. Contact ground, leaving the runway, 590 uniform. Transponder to altitude, carpet cold, mixture rich, flaps are up, fuel selector is on both trim and for takeoff. So this thing's here on 991, Sparkles Tower, runway 13, clear for takeoff, left turn approved. Runway 13, clear for takeoff, left turn approved, 80991. Alright, airplanes configured for takeoff. Bolton, you ready? Yep. I will warn you, try not to look into your phone too much or else you might get nauseous. Uh oh. Yeah, that's a common problem. People take their first flights, you know, they're taking pictures and stuff. If you've got your face in your phone too much, you know, it'll kind of make you. Feel weird. Well, you have uh, the propeller going by so fast. Yeah. That's kind of messing with me. All right. Line up on the runway. Compass and gyro checks out. Full power. All right. Engines in the green. Everything looks good. Airspeed's coming up. There's 50 knots. 55. There's 60 knots. Ease back. There, she's off the ground, step on the brakes. Hey, I'm Maddie. Yeah. Look down there. That's cool. How does it feel, Colton? It's kind of wild. <laughs> the, well, it's a good morning to fly. Yeah. Nice and smooth. A pretty sight, though. Okay, we're 500 feet above the ground. We'll start our left turn. Wind is pretty much dead this morning. There's like no wind. That's pretty good, right? Yeah. It looks so nice. So cool to see it. Everything's really green because of all the rain we've been getting. I know. See for miles and miles. Yeah. All right, we're gonna level off here at 2,500. Gently pull the power back and get some fuel efficiency in here. Basically, reducing the amount of fuel that's going into the engine to compensate for the less, like the thinner air up here. You do all that manually? Uh huh. Yep, all right here. And I just keep pulling it back until I get a slight drop in the engine. There's a slight drop. If I go back in, that's where I'm gonna get my peak fuel efficiency. That's that's 35, right? Yeah, you see all those cars moving down there, that's yeah. Interstate 35. You can kind of follow it, it goes up there all the way to Austin. You can see downtown Austin up there. Oh yeah. Wow. San Marcus Tower, Skyhawk 8099. We're gonna switch to Austin approach. We'll talk to you later. Roger, 
Contact Austin Approach here. Good morning, Austin Approach, Skyhawk November 80991. Skyhawk 80991, Austin Approach. Skyhawk 80991, a Cessna 172, just off San Marcos Airport. 2,500, like to be a uh, VFR tour over the city. Skyhawk 9901, Roger, Austin Altimeter 3011, Squawk 0220, IDENT. 0220 and IDENT, and Altimeter 3011 for 80991. Yeah, it's really smooth this morning. Yeah. What do you think? It's different. <laughs> yeah, it's not, uh, November not as scared as I thought Bravo, I'd be. Bravo with oh, that's good. You can see planes like no, off to the right. Bravo, 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 uh, yes, I'm about uh, eight miles uh, on a heading of uh, zero nine five all over eighty eight Romeo Spice Wood. Uh, requested flight following sir. Uh, it's SR cool to hear like flight. all the commercial uh, flights on the radio too. That's what I was saying. Uh, one, that was an American one, Airlines that was talking. The, that one right there, you think? Oh, I don't know who he was. You want me to call or not? Serious five Bravo Bravo uh, Roger. Everything kind of feels smaller looking out here. What's that? Uh, yeah, everything feels right. a bit smaller looking out here. Serious five Bravo Bravo. Yep. On three zero one one and Squawk four five four two ident. Okay, that's 4542, and ident for 615, bravo, bravo. American 1356, proceed direct, LOL. Direct LOL, American 1356. Colton, you gonna take a picture of Austin? Yeah. Sure. I wonder if the filters reach up here. Yeah, they do. Let's say Austin? Whoa, you're right. What is it? The filters that say, like, hello from Austin. <laughs> Is that a park right there? Yeah. We're right above Zilker Park right now, and the one you're looking at is probably, uh, uh, Butler Park. We're about 2,000 feet above the ground here. You don't want to make one loop around the city and then go swing up to Lake Travis? Yeah. Sure. And then we'll make a loop around Lake Travis and then come back to oh, San Marcos. Oh, that'll be cool to see Lake Travis. Yeah. Yeah, it's over there off to the right, or off to the left, rather. My sister's going to UT next year. Where is UT? Right we're there. About, we're about to come right over it here. Oh. You can kind of see is the red it? roofs over here. Yeah. Or the orange roofs. My bad. I'll kind of level it out here for a second. No, I see it. Yeah, you see the UT Tower. So where's the uh, state capital? We're right over it right now. Oh, there it is. Oh, wow. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Yeah, we're right over it. And also to approach Skyhawk 80991, we'd actually like to go out towards Lake Travis after we make this uh, loop around the city, if that's all right. Skyhawk 9991, that's approved as requested. There is uh, traffic at uh, 12 o'clock and four miles southbound Skyhawk 2000, climbing 2500. Think you'd see our shadow. Okay, looking for the traffic negative contact right now, 80991. And Austin approach, good morning, November 4254 Bravo. November 4254 Bravo, Austin approach. Roger, Austin 54 Bravo, just east of uh, Blanco Landing which is 3 Tango Alpha Papa, en route to Lufkin, um, Angelina County, BFR at 5,000 Number 54 Bravo, state type aircraft. It's a uh, Beach 35 Vintage. Bonanza 54 Bravo, Roger Austin, altimeter 3011. And squawk 5232, ident. We have a full power and climb up 500 feet here. Since we're going to go out of there, one traffic, no factor. Thank you, 991. We're climbing up to 3000. Sure. Mary Zero Julie Charlie, traffic 12 o'clock and 8 miles east northeast bounds of Bonanza 5600. Zero Julie Charlie, we're looking. Bonanza 54 Bravo <laughs> traffic. Two o'clock and seven miles west northwest bound Barron, five thousand one hundred. Five for Bravo, looking for traffic. It's a hydroelectric dam, or 
What's your car now? Yeah. Uh, Altimeter 3011. We might get a little bit of turbulence just coming over the, the dam lake here. Well, just over the lake in general because it's very... The hills crop up around here. Yeah. So the wind gets a little choppy. That's Lago Vista. Baron Zero Juliet Charlie, traffic 11 o'clock, one zero miles northbound, altitude to gates 5,500. Look at no joy, enter Juliet Charlie. Baron Zero Juliet Charlie, Roger, contact Houston Center 134.2. 3420, Juliet Charlie. 1342. 134.20, Juliet Charlie. Tomahawk 62 Charlie, proceed on course, Alpha Quebec Oscar. Of course, 62 Charlie. Tomahawk 62 Charlie, do you have traffic 12 to 1 o'clock and 5 miles eastbound out to gates 4100? Uh, looking for traffic, we're 4001, going up to 45. Uh, you can see the like silhouette of Austin up there. Yeah. Yeah. Cold, isn't it cool? It is, it's I mean. so neat. Tomahawk 62 Charlie, remain this frequency for traffic. Again, that traffic is at. 12 o'clock and 5 miles eastbound altitude, it's indicating 4,000. Austin approach, Skyhawk 80991 is direct, San Marcos now. Skyhawk 9091, roger, San Marcos 8 is Delta's current, advise me on that. We'll let you know when we have Delta 80991. 120.12, advise on initial contact, 80's information, Delta. San Marcos Tower information, Delta, 14500 Zulu. Wind, 1704, visibility 10, sky conditions clear, temperature 21, 2.13. Altimeter, 3013, visual approach and use, landing on departing runway 13. Notice to airmen, runway 1331, non-standard runway working. Runway 1331 and runway 17, Pappy's out of service. By our clearances, contact San Marcos Ground Control 120.12. Advise on initial contact, 80s information, Delta. Approach Skyhawk 80991 has Delta. Skyhawk 9991, roger. Seems odd to say this, but I've noticed Texas has a lot of football stadiums. Oh yeah. <laughs> Welcome to the South. Those houses are huge. Are, the, is, are these rich neighborhoods? The executive weather. I mean, it's Lakeway. It's a very, very nice oh, part this, of the state. this is Lakeway? Yeah. Yeah, Lakeway's really nice. Yeah, you're, like, out that side, you're looking at Lakeway. Oh, yeah, those are really expensive. That's where Matthew McConaughey lives. Yeah. <laughs> San Marcos Tower, Skyhawk, number 80991, about one zero miles to your north, inbound for a full stop. So, it's 80991, San Marcos Tower, and a left base for me, 13. Left base for 13, we do have Delta, 80991. Okay, echoes up now, the altimeter is 3012, and the wind is variable at 3 knots. Okay, 3012 for 80991. Are we changing altitude or something? Because, like, my yeah, we're descending. to pop. Oh, okay. Y'all yeah, strapped in? Yeah. We'll be landing here in a couple minutes. Cessna 99, okay, oh, Cherry, yeah, Cessna 991, runway 13, clear to land. Clear land, runway 138091. Josh, thanks for taking us. That was so Yeah, no awesome. problem. Thanks for putting up with me for so long. <laughs> you were quiet, like, the whole time. Yeah, I was shocked. Well, I was more... I mean, you were a good first passenger. I, I How I usually deal with things that I can't handle is I just stare off and choose to look at all the pretty stuff. That's right. I don't bother to think about the fact that it's several thousand feet up in the air. We're at Juliet, ready for takeoff, runway 13 with a 070 departure. Okay. Archer 6915, so here to the ground, if I can get what's called a sterile cockpit, just basically keep talking to him in a minute. Just like I pay attention to the radio and stuff. I'm glad it wasn't ridiculously bumpy today either. I think that sort of helped. I mean, oh yeah, it always does. Okay, power coming out of the green arc, carb heat coming out. Boost cal, carb, gas on the fullest tank. 
undercarriage down, mixture coming full rich, prop full forward, power set where I want it, straps are buckled in, and flaps. Wait till we're in the wide arc. Okay, there's the wide arc. First notch of flaps coming in. One one thousand, two one thousand, three one thousand. You can see on the wing there, the wing flaps are coming down a little bit. They basically just help slow us down. Put a little trim, and we'll line up at the runway. Second notch flaps coming down. We're nice and high. <laughs> San Marcos Tower, Musketeer 365 to Quebec. Musketeer 365 to Quebec, San Marcos Tower. Musketeer 365 to Quebec is 10 miles okay. south. Cal car. Uh, inbound for landing. Gas and full tank on the carriage next to power. Straps flat. Musketeer 365 to Quebec, in and right base, runway 13, when calm. In and right base for 13, 5 to Quebec. Thank you. And full flaps coming in. You can really feel the airplane decelerate there. Delta, counting ground, 120.12. Okay, right on Delta, 120.12, went off, 80991, thank you. Not a bad way to spend a Wednesday morning before taking a final exam. Flying has always put my mind at ease, and taking up someone who's never flown before makes it even better. I love sharing the art of flying with those around me, especially those who haven't experienced it yet, and I feel that it's my duty to introduce those people to flying. Perhaps that's why I'm working so hard to be a flight instructor. I just enjoy sharing it and teaching about it.